The white liberal differs from the white conservative only in one way. The liberal is more deceitful, more hypocritical than the conservative. Both want power, but the white liberal is the one who has perfected the art of posing as the Negro's friend and benefactor. And by winning the friendship and support of the Negro, the white liberal is able to use the Negro as a pawn or a weapon in this political football game that is constantly raging between the white liberals and the white conservatives. The American Negro is nothing but a political football, and the white liberals control this ball through tricks or tokenism, false promises of integration and civil rights. In this game of deceiving and using the American Negro, the white liberals have complete cooperation of the Negro civil rights leaders who sell our people out for a few crumbs of token recognition, token gains, token progress. Now to two lefties losing it, and frankly, I don't know who is worse here. The racist woman, Yaba Blay, saying all white people are guilty and no amount of reparations will change that, or the silly fool nodding along. White people, I need you to know that your money will not assuage you from your guilt. You cannot pay your way out of this. There aren't enough reparations in the world that you can pay us. And so you think because you write a check or you slide me something in Venmo that you're absolved and you can tell somebody, well, I gave Dr. Blay $100. I'm not racist. Dr. Blay is going to spend your $100 and still tell you that you're racist. Thank you. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. My God. By the way, that's former U.S. soccer player Abby Wambach nodding along like a self-loading simpleton. Uh, talk about a struggle session there. It's just sitting there nodding along and saying, yep, no matter what we do, no matter what I've personally done, nothing's going to uh, get rid of this white guilt. It's all really quite pathetic, Rachel, isn't it? <laughs> I'm just watching that going, what am I watching here? Young black kids growing up in the Bronx who don't even know what the word computer is. They, they don't know. They don't know these things. 